Welcome to a video from thedigitallifestyle.com. New Windows 10 build to look at. This is a build 90. This is a 19H1 build for Windows 10, which is uh, for next year's Windows 10 release. Build 18237. Uh, Nola changes this. A nice one that you'll like. And I've got to say, I had a lot of problems installing this. So did many people. There's uh, multiple threads on this on Microsoft Answers forum. It was the Windows Update service was using all the memory up, so the uh, machine would eventually crash. This it would crash the display driver, had all sorts of problems. Uh, got it finally to install today, so here's my hands-on video. I'll include a link uh, to the Microsoft Answers post. There isn't a fix, so it just worked for me, so whether Microsoft had fixed something on the back end or my machine just finally managed to get there, I'm not quite sure. The main change of this is acrylic applied to the lock screen when you enter your password or PIN. I can't show you that through the recording software because it doesn't capture that, but this is what it looks like. You can see there the translucent acrylic design uh, behind that is a, a normal picture. So you see the normal picture on the lock screen and then when you start to enter your password or your PIN uh, you get this nice acrylic design. And I think there's more of that coming in this Fluent uh, design system. The other chain. The other changes are all fairly minor. They fixed the issue with Task Manager where you couldn't resize it. That's been fixed. They fixed the issue with Settings, um, Navigating to your Account. There's some Save Dialog, Open Dialog boxes. They fixed the issue where opening a link on a PWA app like Twitter wouldn't work, which is good. Um, that was a bit of a pain on the here. And they fixed some display setting issues and some narrator issues as well. The um, There's still a couple of known issues. The around narrator and one on background notifications where the, the um, become, where the action center becomes transparent so you can't really see what's going on. Mine has been okay so far. So there's not a lot of changes but this is early in the development process. The Redstone 5 build uh, pr uh, process is going to be completed at the end of September, rolling out to Windows users in October and then the 19H1 build that this is based this is on uh, will be the update that probably comes out April next year. You can see more on our YouTube channel on the digitallifestyle.com, at Dixon on Twitter, and if you like our videos, please subscribe.